Okay, so I'm going to take you about 1867 with the Constitution, the Confederation Act of Canada. Shortly after, they started implementing treaties. Treaties 1 through 11. 1874, Treaty 4, this territory that we're on right now. The intent of the treaties was a nation-to-nation -nation agreement for peaceful coexistence and mutual respect. And we want that mutual respect. We want peaceful coexistence. They were sick and tired of seeing our Canadian, our federal government pass legislation that directly affects our American treaty rights. Okay, our rights to fishing, our rights to hunting, our right to land, our right to education. This is why we are going to idle no more. And we want you to know more about why we are not being idle anymore. Okay, in 1982, the Constitution Act it recognizes and provides constitutional protection for these treaty and inherent rights. And this is what is happening with this Bill C-45 that's getting passed through legislation right now. What are, they, what are they doing? They're unilaterally imposing changes, making amendments to the Indian Act, to education, to privatization, to accountability. We need to, we need to unify, we need to be heard. We need to let them know that this is not right. They are the government's complete negligence for their obligation to upholding and protecting our treaty rights will no longer be let pass. We want to idle no more. We want to be heard. We want people to recognize exactly what we want to do. I'm going to actually give you a metaphor so you can better understand what's happening with these legislations that are unilaterally being imposed. If you own a house and you let somebody live in one of those rooms of your house and slowly they started taking over your house eventually locking you outside of your house and you're looking at watching them prosper, how would that make you feel? How would that make you feel? That is exactly what's happening with these legislations, these bills that are being passed in the federal government right now. So what I want to do is, I want to let you know, when you actually see these road barricades, these blockades, these flashball ground dances, um, when you see a chief, like the strong chief tree suspense going on a hunger strike, it is, it isn't hurting you. It isn't personally affecting you. All it's doing is taking a bit of time out of your day. And that's what we're doing here today. That's it, I'm done. McGwitch, thank you.
time to research. 